Yeah, I've been sailing since I was five years old. My father introduced me to sailing. He was a keen sailor and he wanted the whole family to become sailors too. I was a top youth sailor. It was my dream to make it to the Olympics until I had a major accident at a sailing regatta which left me quadriplegic. Not long after the 2000 Olympics in Sydney, I wrote to the International Federation for Disabled Sailing to introduce the idea of a new two-person discipline catered for the more highly disabled sailors. In 2008, I got to see the boat I created and the class I suggested make its debut in the Paralympics. I was injured when I was 19. I crashed my mountain bike and broke my back. I was in bed for two months and was told I was never going to walk again. I'm now a very incomplete paraplegic and have regained some use of my legs. I'm able to walk, but not perfectly. My first five Paralympic Games were playing wheelchair basketball. London's going to be my sixth Games, but this time I'm part of the sailing team. I first saw Liesl on a documentary focused on disabled sailors doing the Sydney Hobart race. After seeing that documentary, I really thought I should get her out in the boat with me. I saw that she was focused, she was strong, she was determined. I had an amazing, intense phone call with Dan and he explained exactly what it was going to take to win a gold medal in London and invited me to be part of that journey. So a week later, I'm in Miami with Dan, sailing against the best Paralympic sailors in the world and winning. Wild. Dan and Lisa are very different people, but definitely complement each other on the water. Dan is very methodical, but Lisa lives life like a bullet a gate. After competing in five Paralympics, I think Lisa has a natural feel for sport and competition. And when we're on the boat, this all comes out. I still love playing wheelchair basketball. I've got three Paralympic medals, and amongst those achievements, I still don't have the gold. As a team on the boat, I guess the way we describe it is that I'm the computer and she's the engine. On the boat, it's easy. I'm in charge of the three sails, and Dan's behind me, and he's in charge of steering the boat. Dan has amazing knowledge of the wind and the boat and the water. So with his observation and my strength, together we're an awesome team. Lisa and I really enjoy sailing together. You know, I think that's really part of our success. Dan shows a tremendous winning spirit. He's very determined to not only be a great disabled sailor, but to be a great sailor. We maximise every session together. We maximise every race we chase goals every time we're out on the water. We're athletes and we know exactly what it takes to get where we want to go. What I'm trying to achieve, I'm trying to achieve the perfect regatta and we're going to chase this in London. We do it right, we win the gold, no questions asked. We're both really determined people. After winning silver in Beijing, look, I wanted to step it up and win gold in London. This gold medal is going to be for my mother. She hasn't been well lately, but she's shared the journey for the last 24 years chasing the gold medal.